Today, I will introduce to you this built-in Xiaoyu feature integrated into our Hongmen computer, detailing the methods it employs and highlighting the areas in which its advantages lie. Just click the icon in the bottom right corner of the screen and our Xiaoyu will pop up. So what's good about Xiaoyu? It is deeply integrated with our local system, letting us invoke its built-in apps or have it complete tasks for us. For example, if my mouse pointer is red right now, I can just click the appropriate settings icon. Certainly, please provide the sentences you'd like lengthened to five words. And whoa, the tiny blinking pointer just suddenly and abruptly turns completely black. At this point, it's changed to black for us, and we can also ask it to help with additional complex tasks. With more tasks, in other words, it significantly lightens our workload and boosts our efficiency. For instance, please generate a comprehensive PowerPoint presentation exploring the appreciation of ink wash culture for me. It'll immediately tell us to use WPS and recommend a template. It opens it automatically and starts working as well. At this point, all that remains is for us to pause briefly and patiently await its completion of a preliminary sketch and the subsequent establishment of the principal framework that will underpin the entire structure's design. Then, after fully reviewing our requirements and design goals, we can select a suitably refined template that harmonizes with the ink wash painting style, thus allowing the design team to progress quickly and efficiently without the constraints of time-consuming adjustments. At this point, Xiaoyu has already put together the entire framework for me in no time. If, upon reviewing the content, we notice any minor bits that we don't particularly like or that seem in need of tweaking, we can quickly adjust those elements ourselves, and then subsequently the presentation will be immediately ready for distribution. This is really something that ordinary assistants simply can't ever reliably do under these circumstances.